Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and I had a question that I've seen quite a few times also in different forms and different uh, areas where uh, people go to a website or download something and they get into this message that says the connection to whatever website you're going to, in my case I'm using this website, uh, is not secure and says that you're seeing this warning because the site does not support HTTPS, then you have continue the site or go back. And of course, this message is going to be there more and more because it's Google's way of trying to push every website to be secure HTTP so that there is some encryption. Now, how dangerous is it? Here's the thing. For a website that you're just visiting to view information, and that's all, there is no problem you can continue to the site. Where it is a problem is if the website that you go to asks you for um, a sign-in, for example. If you'd have to sign in or if you'd have to give some personal details, then that is something you should not do on a unsecure website. Uh, the difference is simple, is that we used to have only HTTP, we then started having HTTPS for the secure side, and HTTPS meant that from your computer to the computer where the site is stored, things are encrypted when you're on HTTPS. So it's a tunnel that nobody can actually see what's happening. The problem is that some websites still don't have a certificate for a secure site because it might cause them extra money to spend. And that means that this website that I'm on right now can be viewed from my computer to the server computer. Anybody in between could intercept and see what's here. Like I said, I don't enter personal information here. All I do is view what's on the page. So I don't really care. It doesn't matter. It's important to just understand you never give any details, any information. You do not fill any forms on a unsecure website. So that's the, uh, the, the information that you need to know. So it's not because it says that that it's necessarily bad. Like I said, just reading or just going to see articles or you know whatever is, is okay. It's just that it's telling you that it's not an encrypted page. So it's not as secure as other web pages. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.